What's up crew? Today we have creature compilation number 10, so let's get into it. First up, we have a red-shouldered hawk that I spotted at White Rock Lake, and he was getting chased by some American crows, which was pretty cool. And next, we have a black crown night heron with its juvenile on the right. They look very different, and uh, the juvenile kind of looks like a, another species of bird called a limpkin, which only lives in Florida. Next up, we have a greater white-fronted goose. I think this is actually one of the best pictures I have ever taken so it, it was, and it got right up close to us which is very cool next we have a spotty cucumber beetle which contrary to popular belief is not a green layer bug next we have a green wing teal which is the smallest species of dabbling ducks we've got a herring gull that i saw at white rock lake western meadowlark that i saw at the village creek drying beds which is in arlington very cool place we've got two, two red root sliders that i saw at the trinity river We've got a canvasback, one of the largest species of diving ducks, which I saw at the Village Creek drying beds. We've got an eastern screech owl, which I actually saw in my front yard. Very cool. Not a very good picture, though. Got a painted turtle at the Village Creek drying beds. And the first ever common muskrat on this channel. <laughs> Surprisingly, they're common, obviously. Uh, very cool to see at the Village Creek drying beds. We've got a greater yellow legs, one of the largest species of sandpiper in the United States. We've got a ruddy duck, which is the smallest species of diving duck. We've got a redhead and American coot, which are two species of diving birds. The redhead is a duck, and the coot is not. Here's a common golden eye. This is actually a sea duck, if you look it up. And I saw this at the Trinity River, which is pretty cool. Next up, we've got a red-winged blackbird that was at White Rock Lake. I caught it mid-song, and this is another very good picture I took, in my opinion. We've got a double-crested cormorant roosting in a tree. A cinnamon teal, which is cool because it was a holdover species at the Village Creek drying beds, and there was only two there. We've got a northern pintail, one of the prettiest ducks in my opinion. We've got a nutria, you know, a classic uh, rodent of White Rock Lake, not even native. They're from Argentina, and they're right here in the fur trade. Uh, I posted about them on Instagram, so follow me at wrc.crew. Next, we have the Wilson Snipe, which is one of my favorite species of birds. They're a dumpy little sandpiper, and they're very cool. It took me a long time to get a picture of one. Next, we have a common snapping turtle. A very cool type of turtle. Uh, this thing was pretty big. And finally, we have an armadillo. A very strange animal, but you know, also at the Village Creek drying beds. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe.